off. Yo, what's up everybody? D to the S here. Today, I'm going to be reviewing one of the hilarious and greatest follow-ups to the original, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. Chris Pratt is back as Peter Quill. But this time, he and his fellow Guardians are hired by a powerful alien race, the Sovereign, to protect their precious batteries from invaders. When it is discovered that Rocket has stolen the items they were sent to guard, the Sovereign dispatch their armada to search for vengeance. As the Guardians try to escape, the mystery of Peter's parentage is revealed, but not spoiled for me, that is. Wow! Marvel! How the he- Alright, to start off, the CGI and 3D effects were stunning, no denying that. Like, for example, and I promise you, this is a fact, not a spoiler, but the CGI on Kurt Russell's character was impressive! I in no way know how they did it. It was as mind-blowing as I thought it would be. Also, the lush feel of the environments were so grand in scale, I cannot keep my eyes off of it. Even when watching it in 3D, it felt realistic to look at. Even the camera work and cinematography felt like I was on a roller coaster ride, even in 3D. What more is there to say about it? I was shocked by the 3D in this film. I'm sorry if I'm going on and on about it, but I'm serious. The 3D effects were stunning. Props to Marvel Studios for pulling that off. That's an impressive feat to pull off, I'll say that much. Also, the direction from James Gunn, who also did the first movie, was really great. The acting felt like I was watching a two-hour and 18-minute theatrical sitcom, but in a way that executes the hilarity of the movie. And I swear to you, the comedic timings were hysterical as heck! I was roaring with laughter throughout the whole entire film. I'm not gonna spoil the funny scenes within it, but I will give credit for one scene where Rocket flat out roasts another person just for some stupid name. Whoever came up with that scene needs to be shared on social media because that was super hilarious. I was like, wow, that was so mean. But for some reason, I love it. I mean, seriously, you have no idea. Same with the character development articulation. All the characters were believable. There were certain scenes in this movie that I almost want to shed a tear down my cheek. Like I said, no spoilers, but trust me, you will be hit by the feels once you see this movie. It will hit you hard with a vengeance, and they're never afraid to show it, which was awesome. Also, the story and plotline was creative as well. I mean, sure, it can get confusing to some audiences, but for me, I just found it to be interesting. Remember, no spoilers. In the end, to short up this review, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 was a really awesome film to add to my collection. It was super funny, emotional, and a fun ride to keep you entertained, and I was entertained a lot by this movie. There is no way I'm not purchasing it on Blu-ray combo pack once it comes out, because... I rate Volume 2 5 out of 5 stars. I highly recommend it. Go check it out. You will laugh your butt off once you see it. Trust me. So Volume 2 of Guardians of the Galaxy. Have you seen it? If you haven't, like I said, give it a try. It's super funny. But if you have, come back and let me know in the comments what you thought about it. Also, if you like this video and you want to see some more, make sure that like button shines in your face. That will totally help me out a ton. Also, share that video with your family and friends and favorite it. Also, as you saw at the beginning of this video, click the lower third ad below my face. Remember, you don't have to do anything within the ad. All it takes is one click. That's it. That will definitely show support for both my channel as well as my review. But until then, I'll see you next time. Peace out. Ooh, gotcha.